November the 22nd, 1995. A lone piper leads a young Scottish rally driver over the finish ramp at Chester Racecourse. Colin McRae, winner of his home event, the final round of the season to become, at 27, the youngest world rally champion ever. Colin McRae, 1995 world rally champion. Seems a bit strange, doesn't it? I think it'll take a while to settle in. It's 25 years since those famous victory donuts, a quarter of a century since Colin McRae's proudest moment. A popular win for one of the most popular drivers the sport has known. No, I was at the end of the final stage waiting on coming, coming through the flying finish. And well, Colin was running first in the road. And we had a half idea, you know, when he would come through. And we heard the, the rumble of the, the Subaru coming. And we went, well, we're pretty well on time here. It was, a big, it was a big sigh of relief when, when, when he came to the top board. Six crest and six crest, 50 to stop. <laughs> yes, spot on. When I look back now and think about that event and think about the following that it created, the interest on television, on front pages of newspapers, everyone wanting to see Colin succeed and win that world title. You couldn't see the trees for the flags waving and everybody shouting. This was something that it's hard to imagine, hard to explain to anyone today. You know, we've seen Lewis Hampton win world titles in Formula One, but this was more than that, you know. There were millions of people who go out and watch the event. It was something quite extraordinary. It is incredible and I feel like sometimes I forget how important that was and what a big achievement and big moment for motorsport and for this family it was. 25 years on, another British driver is hoping to emulate Colin McRae's world title success. Welshman Eldon Evans goes into the final round of this year's WRC season, leading the Drivers' Championship. Like McRae, Evans is the son of a British rally champion. Dad Gwyndaf won it in 1996. The Welshman has a 14-point advantage over Toyota teammate Sebastian Auger heading into the final round with WRC's first ever trip to Monza. If he can complete the job in Italy, Evans will become only the third British driver to win the world title after Colin Cray and Richard Burns. Well, when you consider it was a Scotsman, an Englishman and now a Welshman, it, it couldn't be better. And to be honest, if he goes ahead and wins it, it couldn't happen to a nicer vault. Watch WRC Plus on all devices, WRC Plus, all live.